what is up guys welcome back to my channel my camera battery is dying we're off to a great start okay let the camera charge for a little bit welcome to my couch where i start all of my videos it's been a while guys it's been most of the month of january it's been like two weeks january's over <laughs> almost almost let's catch up a little bit what have i been doing since we last talked i definitely said that i was going to make more videos here we are so after i filmed my last video um i've been working almost every single day i had some overnight rehearsals and because of that and working in like high 30s to low 40s at um four in the morning i got very sick and i'm still kind of recovering from it i don't know if you could tell in my voice i feel like i have sounded a little congested or haven't been my voice just hasn't been its full potential for a couple days now um but i was very sick not very sick i've just been so congested and um i'm finally starting to feel my, like myself again it also we got like attacked by winds the past couple days which did not help my allergies and i was just starting to feel better and then it really messed me up again so we're still a little congested it's fine we're doing good it's um not windy today so that's great but what else have we missed um my birthday came and passed i am now another year older i am 28 and i guess that i am officially in my late 20s i really tried to say i was still in my mid 20s and my t when i was oh my god i really tried to say that i was in my mid 20s still when i was 27 even though i'm pretty sure that's considered late 20s mid to late but like now there's no denying it i'm in my late 20s <laughs> but it's been good 28's been good so far other than that i got to go to some cast previews for the new world of color one show and the wondrous journeys fireworks show at disneyland because we are celebrating the 100th anniversary of the walt disney company um both were very good the world of color show was kind of like ruined by the wind so the screens just were not at their full potential they weren't like raised up enough um so that kind of sucked but it's okay um the fireworks did end up happening i didn't think they were going to because yesterday we had gusts up to like 20 or 30 miles an hour it was something kind of crazy but it died down and we were able to watch the fireworks show and you guys it was really really good yeah i got like two little clips but it was really good like probably in my top three fireworks shows at disney and my other two are the 50th anniversary so the remember dreams come true nothing will ever top that for me because julie andrews alone can make me cry um and then my second one would probably be the 60th anniversary i don't know why i'm forgetting what it's called is it called step into the no i don't think that's what it hold on let me look it up it's one of my favorite shows and i don't even know the, the name oh disneyland forever <laughs> duh um that one is one of my favorites as well um i think i think it's just a great show and also i got hired in during the 60th anniversary so it's just kind of like the 60th anniversary will always be special to me you know um but now this one's really good can't wait for y'all to see it <laughs> today i finally have a day off i actually have three days off in a row guys so it's exciting and i figured i would come back on here make some content for you guys i have a couple videos in mind that i want to make um but today we're kind of chilling i have taken the day to just chill i woke up and then i just laid in bed for like an hour because i just felt like that's what i needed you know i've been chilling here watching tv drinking some coffee um i'm gonna get ready soon i do have to run like a couple errands and by errands i mean like <laughs> going to sephora <laughs> <laughs> but I might hold off until later on tonight. I think me and John are gonna go to downtown Disney and look at the 100th anniversary merch. So we might go do that tonight. Anyway, 
yeah I've just been chilling I figured we would make this a self-care day we would make this a having fun on my own type of day so I'm gonna continue to watch some TV I think I'm gonna paint my nails because um, they're looking a little jacked up right now I kind of miss getting my nails done if I'm being completely honest I miss it but I'm too lazy to book an appointment so we're just gonna paint them myself I actually really want to get good at like doing gel nails but I don't know if I trust myself enough for that um, but anyway <laughs> I'm gonna paint my nails I want to read more of my book as we know I'm addicted to reading right now I'm currently reading Archer's voice it's okay um, it's a little childish which I've definitely heard just some of it I don't know just like the the words that the author chooses to use I'm just kind of like why I don't know like she's trying to be quirky and different or something I don't know it's good though um it's a cute little story and I feel like a twist might be coming so definitely gonna read that I'm probably gonna finish that Ooh, I don't know either today or tomorrow so that'll be fun and then I think next I want to get into a court of thorns and roses um, which is a series and there's like four books or something I don't know what I'm getting myself into but it has been recommended to me many times so I'm gonna start it and um, and see what the hype is about okay guys wait I figured I would show you something really exciting it is my name tag for the hundredth anniversary here wait hold on let me hold on okay there we go can you see that super cute so we got to pick our favorite character I picked Mater um yeah there she is it's really cute it kind of gives me like Florida vibes um I feel like because whatever I think it's supposed to be a diamond but it looks like the Epcot ball or spaceship earth or whatever it's cute I don't know I wasn't really sure how I felt about it <laughs> but this is our new name tag for the year this is also my first time holding it it's just been like sitting in a bag and it feels interesting it's also like I don't know the lettering is very thick it's fun it's cute I guess I have had it for a while but I wasn't sure if we were allowed to show it because I know it's kind of like a surprise and everything but I definitely saw a lot of cast members sharing it on like TikTok and Instagram and I was like I don't want to get in trouble so I'm not gonna do it um, but yeah this is it super cute catch me wearing this every single day welcome to my kitchen I have you guys strategically set up so that you don't see the mess that is this corner over here um, we have to clean at some point whether that's today tomorrow we gotta clean but it's almost three o'clock and I have not eaten lunch oh I painted my nails from far away they look great um up close I am not left-handed in the slightest so sometimes it ends up looking like that it's fine because I'm gonna shower and it's gonna all come off anyway but that's what we're working with right now but I was gonna go out to get food and then I remembered that I had something. I mean, ideally, I would have saved this for a day where, like, I could take it to lunch at work. But what does that... It doesn't matter anyway. I'm going to eat it. So, like, it's doing its job. It's this uh, kimchi and tofu soup from Trader Joe's. Um, I'm curious if it's good or not because I love kimchi. Um, so I hope it's spicy. I tried, actually... There is a, uh, correct me if I'm saying it wrong, kimchi bokeumbap at Disneyland right now for Lunar New Year. And I got it and it was really good, but I was disappointed because kimchi is in the title. There was like no kimchi in it. And I expected the rice to have like some spice to it. It was not spicy at all so that was slightly disappointing to me um, but the flavor of the sauce for the tofu that was pretty good so at least we have that okay so I could do the microwave or the stove but I'm just gonna do the microwave because I'm lazy oh my god five to six minutes that sounds dangerous I'm gonna do it in increments of like two minutes <laughs> I thought it would be fun to show you guys what I got at the cast preview um, that I talked about earlier. So we got this fun little tote. 
um that says disney 100 disneyland on the other side so love a good little reusable tote bag then okay we got this purple popcorn which they gave us so many um so this is a closed one but i've tried it it tasted like fruity pebbles i enjoyed it actually maybe i'll snack on some <laughs> today but yeah we got this little purple popcorn i don't know if they're gonna sell it in the parks or if it was just for that event but i liked it we <laughs> we all got a little dasani water bottle nice um and then we got a popcorn bucket okay Ooh, soup's ready um okay so then we got a little popcorn bucket which was this with the hundred design on it um so super cute little popcorn bucket uh again i don't know if this is like what they are planning on selling in the parks or not we were curious yesterday if we can take this in to get reusable like um what is it called if we could take this in to like get popcorn and stuff um but i'm not sure yet but super cute nice little treat that we got let's go get our soup okay this is what the soup is looking like um let's see if it's any good there is definitely kimchi so that's at least promising I mean it's fine I don't know what I was expecting <laughs> it's not the best it's got a little little bit of a spice it's okay um, but I'm gonna eat this and I will check in with you guys when I am finally getting ready okay obviously didn't jump in the shower like I said I was going to I decided I wanted to cozy up on the couch and read more of my book. Something just happened and I cannot confirm or deny if what I think happened happened because now it just jumped back in time. I just, this is about to be heartbreaking <laughs> if it did. <laughs> Next up on the agenda, a little bit of skincare action. We just took a shower, changed into another Disneyland um, sweater. Let's get this show on the road, shall we? Okay, I'm gonna use the Ole Henriksen Banana Bright Eye Cream just for under my eyes. Gonna take a little bit of this hyaluronic acid from The Ordinary. Okay, right now I'm just taking a little bit of Cetaphil or Cetaphil, however you say that. Um, I'm out of my nicer face lotion. Typically I have been using the um, the Superfood Air Whip Moisture Cream from You to the People, but as you can see, she's all cleaned out, so that's why I wanted to go to Sephora. I'm gonna use the Laneige uh, Lip Sleeping Mask, which I just honestly put on at all hours of the day. Okay, um, now I'm just gonna do some light makeup just to brighten up a little bit and not look like I've been sleeping all day. I'm fully aware that this angle is like probably trash 
so sorry about that I actually just ordered myself a new tripod um because I had a Target gift card and I figured why the heck not you know so that should be here but it won't be here for a couple days unfortunately so until then we're gonna have to deal with the um tripod that I have now <laughs> Also, really don't know what I filmed today. Don't know if it's boring. It probably is. Um, but let me know if you guys like these type of vlogs. Oh my god, why did I just put highlighter on? I didn't put my powder. Yeah, let me know if you guys... Oh, that's creasing my nail. Oh no. If you guys like these type of vlogs that are maybe boring, question mark, that are like just me chilling at home. Um... I think that next, I might do a little bit of cleaning because the apartment could use a clean. So I might do that while I wait for John to get off of work. Okay, so on a day like today where I'm gonna be doing very simple light makeup, um, I just wanna add a little pop to my eyes, if you will. So I'm gonna be using my Makeup by Mario palette and this is the Master Mattes palette. Um, I'm gonna take, okay, we're gonna do like this shade right here. And just get that on a little angled brush. And then, okay, hold on. I don't really know how to do this and talk to you guys. I'm just gonna add the slightest little wing. Okay, sorry, I can't do both at the same time. <laughs> um, to just the very corner of my eye so a little something like that okay this is always the eye that i struggle on so hold on please oh my god i got it in my eyeball why do i always struggle with this eye so much okay that might be the closest i'll be able to get them don't know why i always struggle with this eye and this one looks so much darker i think because i confidently do this one i remember seeing a tiktok hack where some girl I can't remember what she did, but it was like she was able to get a perfect cat eye by just like, whoop. I don't know. Let me know if you guys know what TikTok I'm talking about. But maybe I should use that because it never turns out correctly on both sides. Um, but now I'm gonna do a little mascara and call it a day. <laughs> okay guys, as you can see, the sun is starting to go down, unfortunately. It's about five o'clock right now. Hold on, you guys are a little crooked. <laughs> Even though it is starting to get darker later, it still gets dark by like 5.15 at the latest. Um, so I think that I am just going to clean up a little bit. I might, might play Dreamlight Valley because I have not played it in a very long time. But also as a part of this self-care day, we should clean up a little bit. Um, I won't film all of it because I don't know how entertaining it is to watch me clean. I know sometimes I enjoy watching other people record themselves cleaning. For some reason, it kind of like motivates me to clean. Um, but I'm gonna do a little bit of a tidy up. Like I said, I can clean tomorrow as well, but I think for my mental wellness, I should start today because otherwise, I'm gonna be upset that I put it off for another day. Um, so I'm gonna get started with the cleaning and I will check in with you guys later. Okay guys, it is now officially dark outside. Actually, it looks way lighter on camera than it actually is, surprisingly. Um, but I think I'm just gonna end this vlog here. I did a little bit of cleaning. I need to tackle the kitchen. That's its own little beast um, right now. Um, but I don't really know what this vlog was or is, and I feel like why drag it out any longer? Uh, what a chaotic way to coming back to my channel. So, um, yeah. Anyway, don't know what this was. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I will be making more content very soon. And by very soon, I mean, like, I will be making it over the course of my next few days off. And it will be coming to you very soon. Um, but thank you so much for watching, guys. And, um, I guess I will see you guys in my next video.